up, everybody, and welcome back to That Chick Angel TV. In the barn in the beautiful. Barn in the beautiful. Y'all oh, 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 oh. already know who I am. I am That Chick Angel. Down at the end of the table, we got that man, Kevin on stage. We have that girl, Miss Kevin on stage. <laughs> and we got my husband, Marcus ain't on the grass. Tank. <laughs> and Marcus. Uh, Oh, Five or four. Okay. Great, great, great. Bus great. Child is great. We are hungry. Right. So, we're doing another. I am starting. We're doing another mukbang. Mukbang, I'm uh, broke hoes. Per usual, make sure you go to <laughs> Miss Kev on stage <laughs> page <laughs> to see. Uh, we're doing a uh, Married at First Sight review today as well. So, make sure you all check that out. But right now, we want to give a shout out to all the black brands that we are doing right now. This is Maleficent Wings that you can check out. We did Maleficent all the Wings. What type of wings? we got i don't even remember but they're sure. these are honey go no these are honey gold from memphis yeah uh -huh. these are uh yeah, hennessy, hennessy barbecue, barbecue wings. wings these are just uh, asian something asian it is something. asian it and then we've got ciroc uh brandy black owned as wow. well as uh le fete du rosé okay. and i'm wearing beliefs merch too which is black i'm owned. wearing oh not black. champion this which is, is black, black owned. Owned. oh 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 we oh, all wear oh, black oh, owned. Oh, oh. i'm wearing black owned every single episode what you're hearing today? Tabitha Brown. Tabitha, Tabitha, Tabitha Brown. Brown. I'm wearing Life's Journey by Chris Hudson. Black Love Hour, y'all. Yeah. Oh, Black uh, Everything. No, it's the Black Love. Black Love. Black Love. Yeah, there. I keep mixing them up. Okay, today's topic is? And the bakery behind the camera. Oh, yeah, Josh is Josh is black. <laughs> so our conversation today is what we were like in high school. Let's get it. Come on. So, Leave us out. Maleficent yeah. works on the show Blackish. So when I was on the show... Is when I met her, and um, she hit me up and was like, "I want I want you to try my wings." And whenever, and I kept being on a fast every time she would hit me up, <laughs> and I was like, "Girl, we're doing a family fast right now. I'll hit you up." So finally, I had seen enough videos of her wings that I was like, "Listen, I'm not fasting right now. Can you come by?" <laughs> and she brought wings and the um, biscuits and the noodles, and it was so good. And I said, "As soon as I have an occasion." Mm -hmm. That is worthy of mm -hmm. all this food. I'm going to hire you. So she did. She catered my 40th birthday this year, which was all at home. It was just food for me and my family, <laughs> but it was so good. She did Three my meals. breakfast, lunch, and my oh, dinner. Oh, that's nice. It was so nice. Just I said I don't want to have to worry about food. I don't want nobody asking me what we got to eat. And she made deliveries throughout the day. Oh, that was nice. It was Shout out to her. Yeah. Hey. I mean, it we ate bad. so much. It was ridiculous. Me and Josh had some because they had so oh. much food left over. Yes, I brought mm -hmm. some for breakfast for that. I was almost ashamed of how much I ate. <laughs> I'd never be ashamed of how much I thought, God made me this way. He did. Wow, you can taste the Hennessy in these. A lot of y'all probably don't realize. Oh. Ciroc makes a brandy. Okay. I didn't realize it until you showed it. It's not very popular. I don't know why because it's smooth. Mark would be on that dark. I don't say that. I mean, it ain't smooth at all. <laughs> you like to you is. It's not going to be smooth. So what were you guys like in high school? Y'all went to high school together. We, did. we went to high school went together the, the last yes. two years. Okay. But I went to two other high schools. Mm. I went to high school in ninth grade in North Carolina, 10th grade in El Paso, 11th grade when I met Melissa on the first day of school. And I professed my love to her. Mm. And in 12th grade also. Wait a minute, how long before... Oh, you want, are you handing me the bottle? Mm -hmm. You handing him the bottle or I you mean, pouring? You want to pour? Your yeah, hands, your hands is chicken, y'all. Already. <laughs> um, how long of uh, knowing Melissa before you were like, "Let me holler"? For three seconds. Hey, what was it? Tell the truth, Melissa. What? Well, Melissa doesn't. Oh my God. You Charlie Wilson. Wilson did. There you yeah. go. I was, I was like, <laughs> it was on the very first day, and it was. It was on the first day that I fell in love with you. And then that man gave you yeah. that note and you threw it away. And that's when I knew that I had to change. It was not the first day of school. Yes, it was. Why do we have to do this? How many years are we going to do this? Go go How many years are we going to do this? We're going to go off. Go off. Like, you'd be having good memory. No, you know what I'm saying? Maybe you don't have to remember. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. 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 You liked it as soon as you saw it. As soon as I saw it. Mm -hmm. Just like Marcus said, there goes my baby. Did the churchiness already, like, it was exuding? <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, did it exude off of her? How did you mm -hmm. know that she was like. <laughs> so look at that word walking down through it. Yeah, she used to right. wear this, <laughs> this long sleeve food shirt. 
That wasn't even at the beginning of the school year. That's how I know you lying, but that's I, the truth. I didn't say that at the beginning of the school year. I uh, said you used to wear that. And that's true. It was the first time I had any bit of a little bit of money. Mm -hmm. The little shirt? Mm -hmm. <laughs> she wasn't like the rest of the Flucies who were just attacking me, you know. When they I stepped on the scene, it was just like, oh man, who's this guy? So tall, so handsome. Oh, that guy's my computer. Yeah, thanks to the computer. Oh, they called me. Yeah, so it's your computer ringing. Oh. My iPod's on that? I don't know, man. It'd just be ringing sometimes. <laughs> so, but anyway, mm -hmm. so she played hard to get. Mm -hmm. I didn't play hard to nothing. I was hard to get. Uh -huh. She's like, Hello. period. Poop. She went and got a whole other shirt <laughs> before oh. me. That's the shirt. Just to prove her a lot. <laughs> prove her how serious she was. Wait, what did I do? You really got a whole extra year <laughs> year boyfriend. You did? And just a like that. A layover boyfriend? A, lay, a layover yeah. boyfriend. No. Uh -huh. And then I, just like Thanos in, in, in game. Snap your finger. No, nah, I didn't snap my finger. I said, oh, you could not deal with your own failure. And where did that lead you? <laughs> right. Back to me. me. <laughs> so y'all were both popular because I know you I were prom queen. And he was second runner up to prom king. How did you become popular that quickly in the only one, two years you were there? I'm a lovable person. Uh -huh. Everybody who comes around me immediately likes me. Uh huh. In every school. This is the first time he's told the truth, this whole story. <laughs> <laughs> when people hang out with me, they're like, this guy gets it. I like him. This guy gets it. <laughs> Ninth grade, 10th grade, 11th grade, 12th grade. So when you got there in eleventh grade, they were just like, "This guy, where is he?" This there? guy's funny, man. You played basketball too. Played basketball. Oh, that's when you still had hoop dreams. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. I still had hoop dreams. Um, but yeah, I'm a likable guy. What? No, I'm just enjoying. She's the moment. enjoying. Oh, mm -hmm. that was your internal clock being like, "Yeah, girl, we hungry." We. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa, were you involved in a bunch of stuff? How did you become popular? Because you can't say you popular. weren't when they voted for you as prom That's queen. That's what I tell her every time, Angel. No, I, you guys, I really, I'm really not being funny. This is a fluke of nature. I was in band. I was in ROTC. I was in, I ran track. Uh, she was district champion in the 100 meter dash, but so she didn't even run the 100. Well, I tell you, our track chicks was very popular. And you just named off things that would make you pop. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, sorry. I'm like, baby, it's so nerdy. You're in the gospel. But the point is, is a lot of people would know you if you're in all those different clubs right. and stuff. More people would know so you. So uh, did everybody just happen to write you in? You wasn't on the I ballot? Like, she won the <laughs> solo prom. Yeah, she won the solo prom. Did everybody just happen to write you in? You wasn't on the <laughs> ballot? Like, she won the solo, Marcus. <laughs> I tied fluke. with John Christopherson. You are not going to be able to tell me otherwise. It was mm -hmm. a whole entire mm -hmm. Nobody on earth, yeah. the prom queen, except in movies where they picked the mm -hmm. ugly girl to make her life suck. I know. I feel like my life story, if I had it, this isn't the topic, but if I had to choose Jeff a movie <laughs> that would be my life story, mm -hmm. it would be She's All That. Was that the one with Freddie Prince Jr.? Yes. Were they messing with her? Yes. Why, why do you identify with that? Because I'm old girl. How sway? Oh, girl's a good thing, though. No, she's saying that nobody liked her. And that's why I was just you. nerdy. You weren't nerdy. You were saying nerdy can't be popular? She wasn't nerdy, though. I've never seen anybody deny their popularity. <laughs> I was. I'm not denying popularity. You're not. Popularity. I was you are not, not popular. How are you nerdy? What What was nerdy about you? I was churchy. It's probably okay, churchy. Word. I don't know how that it then still makes you not, I'm, you're not telling me what made you not popular. You're just telling me additional This girl is more like, I was, in, <laughs> I was in popular, but you, exhibit A, prom queen, exhibit B, track, exhibit C, band, exhibit D, gospel choir, exhibit. I wasn't in gospel choir in high school, was it? Yeah, yeah. you're saying my desire oh, you is to play. Yeah. What, what's hilarious is that I was That's very true. popular. I, I believe was, you were popular. But I was in all the things you just named. <laughs> Were you prom queen? I was a uh, homecoming queen. My best no, friend won prom but queen. But I believe you were popular. But no, we did the same thing is what I'm saying. That's how I know I was popular. <laughs> I was in track, wasn't good, but I was on track. I was in the band. What'd you play? I was in color guard. That's, that let, 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 really lets you know something. Wasn't even playing an instrument. I was the vice president of the gospel choir, created it. Yeah, so I'm like, uh, Melissa. And I was hella churchy. <laughs> Didn't get no church other than me, other than the House of God girls that only wore skirts. <laughs> Let me tell you about them. No, I ain't gonna talk about them. <laughs> just gave me so, the Melissa, access. do you have any other I'm not evidence? Having these like, y'all not gonna. 
have me lying. Like, my, really? my, my people had money and you was hella popular. <laughs> Face it. <laughs> Live in it. Everybody got to own their part of the Live market. It. Everybody got to own their part. <laughs> yeah. So what made you think you're not popular? Maybe that maybe that'll help me. Because I really wasn't. Like I really just wasn't. Upper limits. Probably. No. Mm -hmm. No, like what about your life made you go, I'm not popular because people were like, what oh, are, who is what that are, girl? What are popular characteristics? So I people know who you are. No, <laughs> that's the big thing. People like you. Maybe enough to vote for you for Prom Prom Queen Queen really is know. killing you. Prom queen, homecoming queen are the most yeah. popular kid things it's ever. It's really a fluke. If you don't remember the day we won, I was like, what? I wasn't surprised at all. Who? I had the whole. I didn't even know my name was on the ballot. I wasn't campaigning. <laughs> exactly. You know what? You know what? Yeah, you that, there we go. That you know what? This makes perfect sense because Melissa point yeah. three point oh the influencer was an influencer before before she decided <laughs> to become an influencer. <laughs> She's the only person I know that could that can rack up a hundred thousand followers and be like, you know what, guys, I'm going to become yeah. an influencer. <laughs> what have you been doing all this time? <laughs> what have you been doing? That's a so, fantastic this point, <laughs> so this all makes sense. That she's like, I am not popular, and everybody's like, who, Melissa, Melissa are who you has a whole podcast, yeah. wrote a whole <laughs> That's what I'm prior saying. to her announcement as an influencer. Are you popular now? Yeah, is that, is that no? Is that right? I'm done having this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know how we got here. No, I'm sorry. I'm the only one telling the truth. Uh, is it right? I knew I was popular. No, you guys have a lot of sub circumstantial evidence that appears to tell the story. Prom queen is not circumstantial. I, I that is a asking, verifiable no, fact. I've been asking for evidence and you just keep saying Because I, I don't even know it. the characteristics of a popular person to refute. Oh. You Usually that a lot of people don't know you. Yeah. You have a small circle of friends. I did have a small circle of friends. You keep to yourself. That's true as And well. people don't know you. Let me tell you something. Oh, yeah. This is how it's going to make sense. I'm going to taste this. Mm -hmm. This no, is how it's going to make Ciroc? sense. Ciroc? I'd like a swallow. Uh, where swallow. The oh, at the top. oh, it's back here. Can you grab a kid? Sit down. You got grease I got it. I got it. I got it. I got to get a napkin anyway. This is why it's all going to make sense okay. right now. Explain to me. I'm listening. Give me a Here it is. Why do I even have a platform? Because I am adjacent to popular people. I'm nobody, okay. first of all. Okay, that, that can, <laughs> no. I'll give you that for now. Okay. That I'm doesn't explain your high school thing, though. Okay, I, we can move on. <laughs> how, how are you in but high no, school? Like, <laughs> put like this, though, and I'm going to shut up. Jordan, Jordan, uh, Sparks. Sparks. No, Ooh, no, no, not, not Jordan Sparks. I Jordan, was excited. The one that be hanging out with the Kardashians. Uh, no, Woods. 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 She's such her. a cutie person. She's nice too. Jordan, you met her? Jordan is adjacent to some very popular people. Mm -hmm. is, but that does not refute the fact that she is popular. You know what I'm saying? Like, even if it's only by association. That's actually really good. Probably really good perspective. That, uh, make, but like she, and now people are fans of her on her own. But I feel like that is more identifiable with my story than okay. I was never Kim. I was never like a Kardashian. I can't understand yeah. that. I, can't understand I was that. always just like, I would be friends with the popular. I would okay. be friends with Angel. I would be friends with like the popular person. Ray J is just Brandy's brother, but everybody knows. <laughs> He's so That's silly. A good point. So no, I get what you're saying. That's a good you're point, saying you're, you feel like you 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 don't equate it to being popular because it was be by association. Exactly. And we're saying here's the, here's the lie. Though, Angel. Here's why yes, that's lie. Uh -huh. My story gonna trump all that. There mm -hmm. wasn't a lot of blacks at Lakes High School. Mm -hmm. It was a cool amount, but not, it wasn't a black school. Right. I can't name you five black girls that were more popular than Melissa. All right. I and you know that's the truth. Angie. So Angie. you are black that's one. Okay. and prom queen Pull up the at door. a white school. She's the one who should have won. Angie? Yes. She was dating Reggie, oh, who went she... to the NFL. But she lost. Oh, man. But... <laughs> lost. Even with that. Even Reggie with who? that on her side. Reggie Williams. Did she come into second? Okay, and that's one person. Name another one. I'm trying to think of the names, because y'all, you know, I don't be my real folks' names. <laughs> that one with water finger waves you know. all the time. There was another little black cheerleader girl that was really popular. Pima. Pima was gone before. Sarita. I'll give you Sarita. Okay. But Sarita graduated before you went prom queen and so did Kima. Oh, they did. <laughs> you were in two. See what I'm saying, Angel? Yes. Melissa has mind. I was the designated survivor. popularity. <laughs> <laughs> How long were you at that school? 
three years. Oh, so you were there. Alyssa has popularity years. dysmorphia. Mm -hmm. She's very obviously popular. Wow. Okay, here's here's what I think it is. Here's what I think it is, Angel. I'm so tired of this. Here's I'm what I think it is. I'm going to move on. I'm going to move on. No, we're going to move on because I want to learn about you and Marcus. I do too. In like those <laughs> movies and stuff, the popular kids, the mean girls and stuff, they kind of like dominate the school. Mm -hmm. Everybody knows who they are. Mm -hmm. They are those people. Melissa wasn't that wasn't person. I wasn't that person. Right? Okay, I can see how that we Right? Like, oh. But that doesn't mean you're not popular. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everybody knows who you are. They like you, which means prom queen, they would like you. They want you to win. Mm -hmm. They wanted the best for you. But she wasn't that like, oh, Melissa's walking down the hallway. Oh, there's Melissa. We got to do it. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't that type of popularity. Mm -hmm. You know, so that is that a fair assumption? That's a fair assumption. That makes okay. sense. That makes sense. So, Marcus, what would you like? Mm -hmm. I thought you was going to go. I was going to keep eating. No, because I, you, you didn't, uh, what you call it, tapped out. That's why I had to bring you back in. I ate more than I did for the cameras roll. Y'all, we had a mound. Of French, french fries. fries. Those fries didn't stand a chance. chance. Oh, so we we, get, we need three like quarters of those next time. She, uh, bruh. I don't care. I had only a bowl of Raisin Bran Crunch. I <laughs> lifted today. I did a full hike. <laughs> hour and 45 minutes. I timed my hungry perfectly for this market. Them fries were still hot when she dropped them off. Mm -hmm. I don't know how, so I'm sorry, but I am also not sorry. how a cooker in a car. Listen. <laughs> But well, go ahead, Marcus. What were you like in high school? I'd love to find I out. I'm keep y'all rolling. But I was keep he did, eating. too. Yeah, go ahead. I was wild, goofy, loud. Um, it's crazy because the whole popular tip. I went in as a, as a freshman. All four years in the same school. As a freshman, I knew a lot of the juniors and seniors because my sister had just mm -hmm. graduated. Okay. So I would hang around her. Yeah. So I knew, knew those. That's so a I good knew. pass in. Uh -huh. right? if, your, if your older brother or sister was, was popular, yeah. was cool. Yeah. So I knew all the juniors and seniors. We was cool. I was hanging out with them. Uh, sophomore year, same thing. I knew a whole lot of seniors. Come junior year, I, don't, I realized I don't know a whole lot of people. <laughs> so you don't know grade. anybody in your, in your grade? Yeah. I mean, I knew them, but it's just like, I can't make new friends. Cool. By then, I went to two, no, three proms already. Did you really? Oh, wow. I went to six proms. Oh, not uh, six? six? Uh -uh. Across different schools. Oh, other schools. No, no, not at the same school. No, I mean, you can't. But did you... Were they were girls that were older than you? Yeah. Sometimes. He yeah. always dated older girls. Oh. He kept that going when he met you? Mm -hmm. She was, was a little brother. too young, but she a dude. <laughs> but uh, so anyway. Um, it's so big when she said Wait, wait, wait. How old were the girls? How much older? Uh, when I was a freshman, she was a junior. They had proms for juniors? Mm-hmm. Because you there's a junior, junior and a senior, senior prom. Oh, got so, it. Well, sometimes they're together. No, they were always together. The junior and senior proms were together. We didn't have that, did we? No, we didn't have a junior prom. Um, let me see. So, uh, sophomore year was at a different school. She was a senior. Wait, how did you get to know somebody from a different school? Kentucky ain't that big. Yes, yes. <laughs> and black folk, yeah. And black folk, too. Mm -hmm. Come on, Melissa. Where do you think I'm from? Apparently, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> like, what? So no, we had, what, five, there were five high schools in Lexington. Mm -hmm. I think there's six now. Did they add one? I don't know. Anyway, and then like uh, there was another one close, a little closer in Georgetown, not in Lexington. I went to one of theirs. Um, oh, maybe if I count the church prom. Oh my God, he <laughs> went to my church prom. Church prom? Anyway, Would let's you? go, no, we get, no. No, I didn't go to that thing. <laughs> What is a church prom? Oh, then look, please, we've got to just take a little. Y'all dancing for Franklin and oh, please, Dawkins? That's what they were dancing to. Please yes. talk. I need Dawkins, you to know. Dawkins, no, 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 no. <laughs> um, My church had a prom. They decided to have it the year that I be, was eligible to go to prom, my junior year. Mm -hmm. And they had a rule. If you go to your prom at school, you can't come to our prom. And I was like, well, well, I'm not going why would they do that? Would they make it exclusive like that. Because they were trying to, one, I was a well, leader. Well, yeah. One, I was a leader at our church. Like, as far as in yeah. out of the youth, they considered me to be a leader. Got it. So, they were hoping that I was going to set some sort of example. Mm, the you were going to be the standard. Right. The difference That's is... That's hilarious. I was, was one like, of, no. Angel blew the whole thing up. Yeah, I was like, are you kidding me? I was one of the only kids at our school at our church that was actually popular in school. Right. Mm. So it was just like this. Church is... nerds. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> and they weren't, they were. Left behind. I'm not going to talk about my, my... <laughs> but a lot of them, they were out here wilding out. So oh, I was yeah. like, this church I'll problem ain't going to do nothing. This church problem's getting that butt. Oh, they, oh, they were trying to prevent Jesus. them from they having wild. sex on the night of their prom. And right, and I was like, they're already they gonna doing it. They're going to have sex at the church at the night of their own prom. Right. <laughs> so, uh, I, that's when me and my pastor at that time that's when we kind of fell out 
Like, mm -hmm. and I was just like, you know what? See, I didn't did all this work here, mm -hmm. giving all my uh, praise, dancing, ushering, singing all at the choir. All weekends and weeknights. All of it. I said, y'all ain't getting nothing else. Listen, 10, 11 hours. Don't 17. go down the path of church hurt, because that's a whole other <laughs> thing. That's now I can deal with any pastor. At 16, I realized, oh, you're a human, mm -hmm. and you will make a big mistake that will break my heart, so I'm not going to even mm -hmm. be on that no more. Good. So uh, there was a chick, the one that I tried to show y'all a picture of a while ago, I think, that uh, I, I just thought was so sweet that went to school with him. And so did her older sister, who's close to my age. And she was like, her older sister was like, Marcus, I, you should take my sister to prom. And I didn't know any In of In short, them. that was how the conversation Wait, wait, I just realized, I don't think I know y'all origin story. Oh, you don't? Yeah, I don't think so. I, realized I just got that. confused. Okay, so me and Marcus didn't know each other at the time. But y'all had a lot of mutual friends? Because Lexington is not that big. And it's only five. So Marcus was a freshman. You were a junior? I was a senior. Senior? Yeah. So at this time, this this happened, I think, this whole church prom and him going was after I had already graduated high school. Got it. Okay. So I wasn't even a part of the equation. But um, I was still a hot commodity. <laughs> Apparently, if you went to six. So he decided to uh, ask not? her. He was like, I'll take you to your church prom. The only reason why I found out is that I was at the girl's house one day for something and I saw their picture together. Now, by this time, I had met him finally. She was like, that's my Marcus. No, I did not say that. <laughs> <laughs> this, is our, this is our origin story. I went to the University of Kentucky. His older sister went to the University of Kentucky. Where she's two years older than me. Um, after graduating, and while I was, uh, well, part of while I was at UK, I lived in an apartment with my best friend. We got evicted because of our dog. Well, her dog that I bought her. So I then needed to find another place to stay. My best friend, we moved in with her mom. Then she moved out with her boyfriend. And I was like, I can't stay living with, with somebody else's mother. mother. Mm -hmm. So his sister <laughs> and another one of my friends, me and his sister weren't friends in college, but another one of my like acquaintances had an apartment together and they needed a third roommate. Got it. I was like, I'll take it. I met him while I was moving in. So he had just kind of I opened the door because there's a knock at the door and he's like, what's up? And just walks in. I don't know who this is. And I was like, excuse me, sir. <laughs> what, what are you? I've been using the room. That was, yeah. my, that was my pit stop. Uh, that sounds like both of you, by the way. It, absolutely. That was my pit stops on my way, on my way I home. I see this 100%. I, I was like. On the what? way home, that used to be my pit stops and my late night rendezvous and stuff on the oh, weekends. Oh, got it. A lot of times like, I would just sleep there. So anyway, I knock on the door. I'm like, do they know? I have time door was just unlocked. It was locked. So I knocked on it. So it's. Chick come to the door with these thick binocular glasses. Glasses were so thick. Oh, these bless raggedy you. Pajamas. Did you get um, eye? Oh, oh yes, I did. Ah! Oh, yes, I did. Angel's glasses was this thick. <laughs> <laughs> and I used to never wear my glasses. I used to only wear my contacts. But I was moving in, and my contacts were still at my friend's mother's house. So I left. After he came in, I was like, oh, God, I cannot be in this house. <laughs> With the attitude and the glasses. Because I was like, who are you? He What's said, I'm Sonya's, I'm Sonya's uh, brother. And I was like, okay. And then he walked past me and I was like, where's your car oh, keys? <laughs> I said, oh, I think she's You don't get a second chance to make that impression. <laughs> I was like, absolutely not. I am caught off guard. No one told me this. Oh, but I had a boyfriend at the time, so. And that made me flirt even harder. Oh my God, he was the most flirtatious. I did not care. He would be in the other room, like, this and just holding conversation and flirting with him. I was like, oh. That's hilarious, So we man. just started dating. Like, if she was single, I wouldn't even flirt that hard. <laughs> he was like, because you got somebody. So me and him didn't start dating until after I moved to California. Because me and my ex at the time broke up right before I moved here. So what's that age, I mean, time gap? Um, let's see here. I broke up with oh, my. A lot of good years. Okay, I was with I was with my ex for like four years. I broke <laughs> up with him, came out here, and then I came home for the summer. So almost a full year had passed. So like five I, years. Five years of like oh from no 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 no. So I met him in two thousand and two. So in two thousand and four is when me and him started dating. Got it. Y'all yeah, started dating long distance. Yep. Mm -hmm. Wow. We started dating long distance. Yep. So Martin, you, you were dating your, work? wait, hold on, hold on. I need to understand timelines, okay? Mm -hmm. Ex-boyfriend, two years, meet Marcus. Ex-boyfriend. And then two years later, you and ex-boyfriend break up. Yeah, that's, okay. a good, that's, okay. a, that's about right, yeah. Okay. And um, so I came back in town. This is what's so terrible. Came back in town, we had the Cracker Barrel. 
Well, my family at the Cracker Barrel. You know His family. Down, Did you get the the Mama Sunset? <laughs> I got Uncle Herschel's favorite. Uh, <laughs> my favorite. Um, his family is at Cracker Barrel. He's we not crossed paths a couple times though. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like we seen each other in the club without the glasses. Yeah, without yeah, the glasses. Okay. Oh yeah, that's, that's, that's the thick roommate right there. <laughs> thick roommate as a yeah. person or thick glasses girl? <laughs> no, thick guy. Thick guy. Thick guy. Oh yeah, I used to work out in the living room when he would come by. And I work out with these little red shorts. <laughs> yeah, squat. With hey, out the ah, gotta get this in. I said, yeah. <laughs> I said you know, good and good well she wasn't working out. <laughs> Surely wasn't. <laughs> Then, so anyway, uh, we at Cracker Barrel. His we met sister, at a park one time. His sister, uh, it was at UK where they were having a party in the park. But um, um, his sister was like, hey girl, I was like, hey. You know, we were good friends since being roommates. She was like, Marcus, ask for your number. And I said, well, did you give it in <laughs> to him? <laughs> she was like, well, he's on his way. Mind you, I have on my glasses. I got a hand, Angel. You yes. see the glasses are, are, are over his locker. Why are you going to wear the glasses to this house? You know she's relaxing. Hey, y'all, them glasses. And <laughs> we in Cracker Barrel. We in Cracker Barrel. So I said to my family, listen, I'm about to put in these contacts. Uh, there's a dude coming. I want y'all to pretend like y'all don't know this, okay? <laughs> and so sure enough, um, and say, for instance, he's walking from back here. I've already spotted him. He didn't see I spotted him. I'm like, here he comes, here he comes. Here he, comes. <laughs> he tells me on the show. Look, I'm I like, don't speak to my family. I look up. The entire table is looking at me except for Of I course. Am. Here he comes. Don't look. Don't look. <laughs> Everybody. <laughs> That one. Yeah, people, there. People, black people don't never take that yeah. right. As soon as you say don't look, your eyes are like, don't look where? Don't look where. I I'll need to look. Now. He taps me on the shoulder. And he taps me. He's like, I'm like, oh, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Hey, huh? We have a little conversation and afterwards. He was like, how long are you going to be in town? I was like, oh, I'll put you a couple days. He was like, well, I want to take you out. Uh, before you go back, and I was like, "Cool." Now, mind you, his mama, his sister, and his uh, uh, his niece and nephew's mom are all standing there with us as like, we're having this conversation. I'm trying to hold on. Oh, these, no. these nephews are all up in the conversation. Oh, no. <laughs> so I'm thinking, <laughs> did she say yes? She did say yes. <laughs> like said, literally, what's the date? Ten o'clock. Does that work for you? <laughs> it, it would be like if if you were Marcus and he were me, and they just like, oh, not between y'all. Yes. I was like. <laughs> So I'm thinking, okay, we're all going out to eat. Is that what? <laughs> I had to call him later that day and be like, hey, what is this? Is this like a, what? why did you ask me out? He was like, because I couldn't before you had a boyfriend. I was like, okay, I just want to make sure I wasn't sure if you were asking all of us out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to pick all y'all up. We just go down to church and yeah, I'm going to get us a 20 so piece box. So that's that. The visual of them going back and forth. It was like, cheesing. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was like, this is so weird. So that's our origin story. That's how we started. Dating. I've never heard this story. No. Me neither. That was fun. Yeah. That, more that is the most story. Kentucky thing ever to to you have your first date proposal in the Cracker Barrel. It's been a Cracker Barrel. <laughs> that is so a Kentucky. Across from it family. Across from family. Absolutely. Oh my god. Um, but in high school, uh, in high school, I was popular. I didn't get to that school until the second semester of my ninth grade year because I moved around a lot too. Everybody thought my mother was military. Um, I just asked her for high school if I could just remain put. I was like, please, <laughs> just let me finish out strong. I was, a, like I said, in color guard, choir. I was just involved in a lot of stuff. Just a whole, and our school wasn't that black either. It was very few black folk. Mm -hmm. Very, very few. But like I was class vice president. I was just doing all of it. The most I wanted to look good on a college application. Um, that's what you, that's why you did a lot too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You were in R. You you didn't do ROTC after tenth grade, right? I did ROTC I I after. Yeah. No, I did it in ninth grade and tenth grade, and I was like, enough. <laughs> I actually quit band after tenth grade too. I was like, mm, yeah. All this stuff she did. What did you play? <clears throat> alto saxophone. Mm. But she did play. You did play in that uh, Black History uh, oh, Challenge. Well, let's play. It wasn't uh, Black History. It was a. Um, I said a Black History Challenge. It was uh, a um, show, wasn't it? It was the Black. It was a pageant. Black something. Did you have any pageants? I did one, that one. It was like the black, I don't know. It was the equivalent of the Daffodil Parade, but for like black people. Yeah. I don't remember what it was called. But anyways, it was, it was like, played, uh, it was literally like a pageant show. Like you had to do a talent and answer these questions and like come out in these outfits. Love it. She I was played, a pageant girl. I believe I love the children it. are yeah. <laughs> 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 I literally played that. Yes, I love it. 
I was like, go ahead, man. Oh, it was so good, man. Oh, that's so funny. I love it. That was the only pageant? You didn't like that? I've only done one. Oh, I love good pageant. Oh, I love a good pageant. I used to even coach pageants. That's how much I love it. <laughs> Zoom in right there. <laughs> you were like, I'm done performing. You know, I'm retired myself. But I'm going to turn up the next crop of Yay. for you. I love the it. had to climb up the mountain to ask for her guidance. <laughs> <laughs> how do you train for a pageant? I know what it was. We went to get, eat food last time, and that's why I thought we did a mukbang. Oh, yeah, we went and got drinks. We I thought, I'm like, that. I know we ate. We should have recorded that whole thing. That's why yeah, I've, been, so I've been sitting here thinking, why did I think we got a mukbang? And we been, just, we've been quoting you all week. <laughs> I'm having a great time. <laughs> that's actually the time of my life. I literally was that right You now. were in the parking lot earlier. That's <laughs> really I was like, I know we ate last time. Yeah, Why am I confused? Great. And yeah. it was because we went to that we restaurant. Yes, it was. That was a good time. Oh, it was great. Yeah. That was a good. Let me tell you about like Angel. <laughs> Angel was arguing with the with the waiter. With the waiter, <laughs> she had a drink. It, it was a sangria. Oh! <laughs> and she said, "Yeah." Uh, I want the one with the spritz, right? And he said, we don't have that. She said, it, right here, it says that y'all got the spritz. It did say it, though. <laughs> y'all got the spritz? It did say I it. I said, Angel, that man said he don't have it. He said, let me go see if I have uh, it. Come on. And then he went and got it. Oh, yeah, I got the spritz. And then she didn't like the drink. Because <laughs> it didn't have no spritz in it. Don't say it's going to be sparkling. It ain't no sparkle. No, it was just a spark. It didn't yeah. have the clean. I was like, come on. He said, well, it's just club soda on it. Yeah, put more on top of it. <laughs> As I'm telling you, what 40, I want. Forty percent of the time, Angel gonna have the day with the waist. Really? No. My no, brother is the oh, absolute my God. worst person ever. I love him. The worst person to eat with. This wow. man done went to uh, Red Robin. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, I hop or oh, Diddy's. I hop. I hop. I hop. Why? Uh, no, no, no. I went with him. I will not. Another story. Keep going. Sorry. This <laughs> man is gonna so tell mean. I hop. People, uh -huh. can you make thin pancakes for me? And they were like, I mean. The whole thing with IHOP pancakes <laughs> is that they're big, big and fluffy. fluffy. So the yeah. waiter's like, they just, like, we just press a button. Right. It kind of comes out. Down. It's like mostly mechanical. They were like, do you want crepes? Because we have crepes. And he was like, no, nah, that's too thin. So you want us to create a special recipe of pancakes <laughs> for you, this one person? Like, like we don't make 7,000 pancakes a day? That's too thin. <laughs> he cannot go to a restaurant. And and try to he switch just, something no, on the menu. He oh yeah, he's like okay, so I see what you have, <laughs> but my request is right. right. Can you have papados huh. at Red Lobster? Right. Right. Exactly. Right. It's, it's right. never right. like can I? So you should not have come here. <laughs> Literally, Marcus. It's never like hey, can I? You know, this come the burger comes with fries. Can I get broccoli? And they have broccoli as a side. Mm -hmm. It's like hey, we don't have broccoli in this restaurant. Do you? Could you just have someone run out to the nearest? <laughs> Aldi's and just just steam it real quick. It'd be really stuff like that that don't be on their menu. He just needs so your home. thing was nothing compared to what. Yeah, I'm not that bad. And I ain't not that bad, but she will ask them to compare two polar opposite things on the menu. She'd be like, Yeah, do you prefer the spaghetti or the pancakes? <laughs> like, hey, they could say that the spaghetti is twelve trash. hours apart. <laughs> 12 then hours ask, apart. Then, then ask them how the spaghetti is. Is it good? No, she don't compare. It gets, gets it to you quicker. The catfish quicker. or the lamb. It's too like, hard. I, I can see the T-bone or the rib eye. Like, but it's two completely different. What do you like all... better, the meatloaf or the Sprite? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, they usually have an answer. They, they have like... an answer because they got to shut people like you up. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I mean, listen, they want they tip, come up with an answer. You might be wrong, yeah. but at least I don't have to <laughs> debate it. Let me try something new, though, please. Marvin, did you play any sports in high school or do any activity? Yeah, and, uh, what'd you what'd run? What'd you run? Don't Four by one. Oh, one what, were you, what leg were you? Third. Slow. Slow. You, Okay, we was all there. Um, short dudes, that was all quick. And the football players, they they ran track in the offseason. They did. They did. did. So they football players would be fast. They would be fast. I read the hurdles. Swift. Yeah. But um, four yeah. by one and what else? Yeah. And long triple and high jump. Oh, okay. That's you should be. Yeah, you oh yeah, I'm about to say you probably look like a jumper. Let me tell you what. I love Melissa because I would go to these dog on track meets and track meets are long. And Melissa ran too long. And her sister ran. Yeah. And they both 
like they ran, they were sprinters, and you know the meets open with a sprint mm -hmm. and right. close with a sprint. Right. So you be at them doggone things all, all day. day. I ran the four by long. one, I ran the one hundred, I ran the four by two, and I also well, and I ran hurdles mm -hmm. in between there, and then I also ran the four by one, which is what closed. Usually that's, man, that's that doggone four by one is you, you, you gonna be yeah. you gonna be at the track meet to the end, so the and then her sister ran the it's open so four. Mm -hmm. It was great, but. Track meets are long, but we would have, at that time, I don't think we had cell phones that that were crazy. Like, they would call, but you couldn't, like, yeah. uh, entertain yeah, yourself on there. I was going to say, I had a pager. Seat. I never had a pager. Really? I had a pager. I had, I had, a, pager. I had a pager that was never on, and I would, like, flick it and make it buzz and be like, oh, I got to take this. I had a pager. I didn't pay the bill. They never uh, charged me. That was my first part debt was a pager because the credit card company gave you a free pager <laughs> mm. that's what they had them at on campus you know how they be trying to get college students yes they're like you want a pager yeah so open up this credit card and then i just didn't that's the predatory when did you graduate in high school 2000 no nope that's a lie 1998. <laughs> 1998? 1998. So you graduated forecast money records took over for the 99. <laughs> yeah. They had taken over yet. They were taking they over. Were they were in college when that record came out? I saw out? I saw it coming. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> that's, that's a good time. Good time. First of all, that song was popular for like, well, it's still popular. Yeah. But I, I'm talking about in the lingo for like 10 years. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cash yeah. money taking over. We yeah. said that for Maybe 10 years. Did y'all have songs yeah. in y'all room? Say again. Did y'all have your own phone in your room? In in, in high school. In high school. Oh, heck no. No, I didn't. No, did you? I don't I even know. Might have. No, he did it. He could have, but his parents. Oh. I, the only luxury I ever had in life was a pager, and I'm not even quite sure how my parents afforded it. Now you got a car in high school. That was a luxury. What? But I no no no. Everybody, calm down. What? I had a car that was the oh. same year as me. <laughs> that no, that thing was literally born the same year. Nineteen eighty three. I would have died for that. You literally the whole time we were together, we never saw that car with anybody else in Washington. No. <laughs> she had the and only ninety. My dad played Accord. Accord. Uh, Honda Accord. Oh, still running. Um, oh, you know it's somewhere right. It's probably in Washington right now. Like, so oh, I knew this was that. Well, she, she had him back. She had him. <laughs> that, that car thing, never did me dirty. First of all, it did. Because no, it, it would, yes, it did. It would not go up here. Oh, it wouldn't go up here. <laughs> and it would go up here. We would go up here. But the and Tacoma is, have a lot of hills. Seattle. And see, oh, the Seattle hills was even worse. Yeah, I mean, you Seattle would have to plan your map quest because my church in Tacoma was <laughs> on, on a hill. hill. So we'd have to go up on the freeway and come down <laughs> and then leave and keep going down. <laughs> 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 Give me an elevation view of this. <laughs> <laughs> that Honda did everything but go up hill. Yeah, it was like, true. listen, man, you know, I'm up in 83. I, I can't do that hill. I can do it. You know, they knew it went out. <laughs> I love that little car, though. That car was great. Car's my was my dad you. made me and my sisters learn in a stick. We took our driver's test in a yeah, stick. And so, yeah, my dad, well, my dad, was a um 88 Mike in the military, which is equivalent of a truck driver, to be honest. Uh, and so he was like, All Marshall girls will know how to, <laughs> how to drive, drive, a, how stick, to drive a stick, how to change a tire, and how to change your oil. That's, That's right. right. That's what I'm talking about, right? I don't know how to do none of those things. <laughs> Hulk, like, stick. you know how to change oil? No. <laughs> he know. But you. my daddy taught me. <laughs> he taught you how to change oil? Yes, I just was like, Okay, I got it, and I'm gonna find me a husband. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna find somebody to do it. That's hilarious. Kids know how to change oil? No. <laughs> no shame in it. Absolutely. My first two cars. You said if I did know how I purposely forget. I literally, my dad got mad at me because he didn't teach me. He was like, I, I failed you. I never taught you how to change the oil. Because my first two cars, I had engine locked up because I never got the oil changed. He I had a stick. Doing that. I had a stick. I had, no business with the stick. I knew how to drive, but boy, I would strip some gas. Oh, cars. God. Uh, 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 thirst to thirst. <laughs> No, I would be like Ugh, the first car that was mine was a stick. Yeah. I was just thinking when I was driving today. Yeah, I've been driving for twenty one years, and I am no better than I was <laughs> when I got my license. I am the absolute worst. Why? Why? Are you I just don't that? care. You feel like the Lord means Melissa you have a be, chauffeur. I was about to say, yes. you meant to be chauffeur. Yes. 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 Okay. Melissa B in the car. Josh can attest. Anybody who rolled me. He so is. Melissa B in the car, girl. <laughs> She be breaking with her hands. I do. She be. You don't see the red lights. No, they There's don't. There's so many. Listen, I don't be looking at the like cars. This. I do. I <laughs> she am. be pushing. I don't look at a whole bunch of cars ahead of me. Oh, that's I wait problem. until the the, oh, no. the car in front of me break. Let me tell you about the Maserati. It, it breaks for you. Stop depending oh. on that. That's what you need to do. <laughs> I was like, this is great. 
I was driving, wasn't paying attention. It said, boo! And then it pressed the brake for me. I said, thank I you. I actually don't like that. The, it also, the robots are taking over. It also sure. feels like it steers for it you. It absolutely does. I don't like that either. Yeah. I need control. It be doing lane I'm correction. driving. Mm. Mm -hmm. That would bother oh, me. Oh, so if you... Sure, yeah. it'll, it'll, in you know, high school, also, Melissa used to let me drop her car during track practice. It was great. Uh, no, I, I was a bum. I would drop her off at work and take her car to Walmart. Oh, <laughs> yes, you were. I, but I would be, oh, I was terrible. But I'd be back to pick her up on time. See, back off on. Oh, I never felt like more of a man <laughs> than when I had her car and she was in track practice. Wanda Adams? I would, I would go to Walmart I with no money. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you let me do that? It really wasn't part of your personality. It, actually, uh, I don't know. Because actually, it's not. Like, that was showing ownership because everybody knew what was up. Like, oh, yeah. I yeah, you, the N word on here. You, you got to bleep that out. You don't say it? You don't say it? On oh, my channel? Not on my channel. Mm -hmm. not on my channel. <laughs> she bleeds my dad all the time. It's fine. When you stop doing that? I never <laughs> did that on my channel. <laughs> you never do? I don't do it in my content. You don't ever say that? When I say you something. You don't say it in my Oh no, I say it a lot in life. Oh, I okay. say it in my content. God, I say something that Angel wants, um, don't want to edit it out, but I do. I just start cussing for the next 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. He's like, oh, it's always going to come out. It's coming it's, out. You're going to have to cut everything because I'm going to cuss all around this. <laughs> what made you decide not to say that, to do that? You I've want to make white been, people happy? No, I've always been like hella brand friendly on this channel. Really? Oh, yeah. For Forget me. the brands, cuz. You are who you are. Edit that get out. Uh, unless y'all paying, then whatever. Hello, it's sir. My name is Kevin. I went to an Ivy League college. Uh, I was down the yard. No, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. Hello, Procter and Gamble. No, we don't say words like that. Over Diddy. Here. You guys, I sponsored this. I We're drinking dark all. liquor. You talking about? I don't say the M word. I know. Dark liquor and chicken. It's the blackest thing ever. This is it dark liquor and chicken. I've always been. I've always been black. I've just been like. Brand friendly black. I forget that man. I've been a mommy influencer for a while. I wasn't a comedian influencer, so that uh, that is different. That is a huge. Difference. That's yeah, an awesomeness talk. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so I'm Kevin like Ray lose you nine commercials. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like so as a mommy influencer, you got to be on brand. I know a lot of people who have more numbers than me. The brands are not gonna mess with because they mm. curse too much. That's true. Yeah, that's true. My so, uh, I got a couple of friends though, and they were just like they couldn't even vet people I was with. They were like, uh. uh, uh. No. Yeah. Because they cuss too much. Yeah. People I'm, cuss. They do cuss, but they just don't want to affiliate with their brand. I cuss in my stand up, but I've never never used my stand up as a way to get more followers. Speaking of right? stand up, Angel's gonna be at the eh, October what, I, this? Coming yeah, out I'll have this to be out this coming week. So they'll have a whole nother week. Use the code week. Angel because she gets paid a little bit every time you use her code. I didn't know Support. it. I didn't even don't know. Don't even it. use my code this time. You didn't know it? I didn't know it the first time. Y'all do not I pronounce know. at th that there. Y'all be like, like it. That's why like, somebody else said that. I gotta look back at something that I just. Y'all be said. doing it a lot. Like it. And that's, that's, like, what we, that's how we talk. I know. Like it. So come off of it. Like it. <laughs> right like here. Right there. What is Kentucky considered? It doesn't Nobody know. Knows. It doesn't know. It's yeah, so I just know realized. Just like, is it I was South, looking at the map Midwest, and I'm like, it's it way it, over. That's exactly so what I thought. It's not, it's not, not quite Midwest, but it's not South either. It's in between. It's in between. You have Ohio. Yes. Tennessee. You have Virginia and St. Louis. So you got uh, uh, that uh, so that corner next to Tennessee probably feels more southern. Yes, but then Ohio's the next state up. Yes, uh, and that's Midwest. Yes, like with St. Louis. Louis. What's yeah. funny is that I can see you being both Midwest and Southern. Mm -hmm. And I think that's why like I asked the question. Like there, when they were saying that in yeah. Kentucky, I'm like, that's how you already talk. Yeah. yeah. You're saying it like, like they over there, there. you already saying over there. Because ain't the Lexington Airport, can't you fly to Cincinnati? Yeah. Or that's Louisville? There's all of them. They're all like really Lil close. Lil yeah, we Louisville, Cincinnati, on. and Lexington are all 45. So Let me tell you who didn't know that when they were booking the tour. Me. Oh, right. We booked, we was in Did Indianapolis. Did we go to like, like San Francisco or something? We went from Minneapolis, Minneapolis. to Seattle. Seattle. And then, down and then to back. Yeah. We went to Richmond, Virginia. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't Literally, know Kentucky we was, like was that close to Indianapolis. Oh. Louisville was no, like 45 like, minutes, wasn't it? Yeah, it's not that far from and Indianapolis. And we booked it like, it was like an hour and 15. I didn't know that. I was like, wait, what? I don't be knowing geography crazy like yeah. that. Not and not I didn't spend a lot of time in Kentucky, Indianapolis, or yeah. Tennessee. Like, Kentucky's so confused that during the Confederacy, it was half and half. <laughs> like, <laughs> really? Hilarious. The bottom half hilarious. was the Confederacy. That actually defines Kentucky. Yes. It, like, literally... 
visualizes my confusion. That's hilarious. The top half was like, I mean, come on, guys. We yeah, get it. Exactly. we're in the north. Not That's willingly, but they were just like, why fight? <laughs> they were in the north. What's Dred yeah, Scott in Kentucky? Who? Dred, Dred Scott. Scott. The, the slave case, the runaway case? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know so much history in that goddamn yeah, He just called us out and everybody gonna be like, how y'all not know? And you know, I still can judge. I mean, I can still edit that out if we just make us <laughs> not look stupid. And just say Dred Scott was in. Dred Scott was. <laughs> I don't think. Are you looking it up? Yeah, because I don't know. Dred Scott, Missouri. St. Louis, Missouri. Oh, that was Missouri. Now it's right. It's yeah, true. so yeah, that's what I thought. Wait a minute, the Dred Scott case. Yeah, we was right. <laughs> yeah, no, that's why I didn't sound familiar to the Kentucky history because yeah. St. Louis and things of one nature. Mm -hmm. Did y'all go to uh, the, um, what's that race? Derby. Yeah, did y'all do, 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 do derby activities though? Let Apparently the derby activities are big. Yeah. Louisville, actually st the state of Kentucky, but Louisville shuts down for derby. Uh, really? Like, you heard of Freak Me. Yeah. I'm saying, you got I'm Churchill went. Downs where the race is. Mm -hmm. All the surrounding parts of that is black folk out in the streets, cars parked. I'm talking about dudes is come people coming from New York all over. Really? With yeah. Like the craziest cars. Chicks is walking. And down don't the care nothing about the race. In baby no. suits and heels. Not like, baby suits and heels. Sure so black folks care about it because of the offspring event. Yes, yes. yes. I remember I the mean, only people time. Still have some black things. Oh, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. No, no, no. no, no. Uh, so Ain't nobody people, here to actually attend that. <laughs> no. Yeah, you care about the dog horses. People are into it because the derby for everybody else is like this big thing. There's a whole season leading up to the derby right. that's real big that everybody goes to. Makes like sense. they go to all the other smaller races. And do gambling and everything. Black people or just black people, people, people? Everybody. Okay. Let me say it Because again. the Kentucky, it reminds me of Southern race. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. They didn't have those, uh, yes. the it's, hats. It's the hats the, for me. Those barber the suits. Mint juleps. The, mint yeah. juleps. Yeah. <laughs> those, those, uh, yeah. what are those suits called? Not pinstripe, but, um. Confederate soldier. <laughs> Zoot suits? What are you talking about? No, I can't think of the name. Don't worry. Bald and Beautiful is going to the Kentucky Derby. We go oh, it's yeah, going to happen. I would do that. Dude. Oh, yeah. I, I love the race. It's, it's Listen, a baller ass time. We just talked about it. And I was like, well, we're ahead of us. We're going to go to the world races. 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 Well, you, you got to get the special right? engineering for this hat. We're going to need this. Right. It's going to be ready. Who's going to shut it down? She's going to be ready. This is so great. No, like, you didn't Can see, you didn't see black people. <laughs> I don't think I've ever even had a mint julep. I have it. But we so, uh, no, you don't. Uh, a lot of times you don't realize how much in the races black people are until you get older. The yeah. races? And it's like, yeah, the races. Because uh -huh. then you see, oh, like, oh my older cousins are going to the races. Like, oh, let me start getting G'd up. I'm going to go to the race too. That's been like early, late 20s, early yeah. 30s. Yeah. You see more and more people going. Uh -huh. And it was like, of course we go to the race. But when you're younger, don't like it. Yeah, when I, I when I was younger, it was like it could have been a lot of black people. I was just down there on that main strip of Broadway in Louisville. Yes, that's what mattered. We literally walked from people that know know how long this is. We were walking, didn't even realize it, from one McDonald's to the next McDonald's on Broadway. So it had to be a good three, four miles. Uh, and we had no idea. We parked in the middle of the street because there was no, it was that many people, and we just got out and started walking. Wow. And I mean, it's just be cars and black folks. I want you to know how like small it. this town must be that you literally just said from one McDonald's to the other. Oh, McDonald's is important to Kentucky. <laughs> <laughs> McDonald's and Walmart. It's a blood. Like the fact that there's only two. No, 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 no. no, 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 no there's not only two. Oh, but but they're that far apart. Like, oh. you go to Target and walk to the next Target and see how God, it's going to take, take you a little yeah. bit of time. So it's like that. It's a bit tense. It's a bit tense. It's a bit no, it's uh, it, no, it's a, like a lot. It's a metropolitan area, but oh, okay. like for people that know that area, to measure that out, it's got like, you. Y'all walk that far. Got you. I remember the only one time I went, my abs were ready. Yes, I was about to abs. Yes, I was about to show these. Let me show y'all. What else? Got about them? I don't. It looked like you got. I done lemon, up another lemon biscuit. Over here. It is. It does. Oh, I'm yellow cake. Lemon cake. Yeah. I'm so excited. You want to split this oh, yeah, I actually want like a okay, quarter, well, but I'm gonna have some of that. You want it's the half? it's the top that looks like inviting oh, yeah, to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. You want this half? I want a quarter. That's what I'm saying. Half of this would be a quarter. Yes. You kept saying you want this. I mean, y'all will just be able to take that whole thing home because I'm not going to. But I'll okay, take that one for my mother. Um. Yes. No. It was it was the time to be able to stunt. I had just I had a pretty weave put in <laughs> with the. The deep waves in it. Okay. I had on one of them like J Lo like crop uh -huh. shirts with the big fluffy sleeves. Did you change your name or you were still Angel? I was still Angel. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was Tony. My uh, he wrote he wrote Tony. Mm -hmm. 
I have my belly button pierced at the time. Oh my gosh, oh. I have my belly button pierced too. Oh, you very did. Did. I did. The reason she stopped it is such a mom thing. It's because I had kids. She had JoJo, and that boy would kick that belly button. Yes, they would. And it he hurt just, kicking it. And I was like, you know what? She was like, I'm, you know I'm what? I'm a whole entire mom. This is inappropriate. I used to have a nose ring, and I took that out. Uh, Did you ever have your tongue pierced? No. Do you have a tamp check? Uh, what do I have on tamp? A tamp stamp. Oh, I was like, how do I have Wait, wait, wait. A tramp start. I was like, that I don't know what that is. I was like, what type of tamp? I haven't had it yet. Tom? It was a lot to get out. Melissa's at it again. Yeah. <laughs> I had, no, I have a tattoo on my hip, but I want to get one more tattoo. Of? A comp, some combination of my children's names. Oh. Because you're done. Oh, yeah. My Hold dad on. has me and my sisters on one, I'm spitting, sorry, chicken. Uh, on one on side of his chest, <laughs> and then all of his grandkids on the other, except McKinley and. Uh, He's done. He said, I can't do it. And no tasted more. the last two. He was like, Honestly, I'm too old for this. <laughs> right. He's like, I'll get a shirt made. Which I've been campaigning to get on the right side of this chest with the girls. Like, come on, man. We've been <laughs> well, let me tell you, years, man. Well, that just made me sad. <laughs> I was going to say, my mom used to be pissed when we were young. My dad got those tattoos when we were kids. Mm -hmm. And um, he calls me his angel, my sister his heart, and my youngest sister his star. They're Captain Planet. <laughs> They put their stuff together. Right? We are daddy's girl. We are daddy's girl. And you can be one too. Okay. Love it. Oh, our daddy <laughs> has a thing to do. That's hysterical. But literally, so in our the eyes of our names, that's what he has. Like, oh, I love it. Our heart. Mm -hmm. And so, um, my mom used to be pissed oh, that he her. didn't have her name. And now they're divorced. No. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Come on. Oh, yeah, was, that she didn't get uh, her, her mom used to be pissed at her. She wasn't tattooed on, but now they're divorced. It's been twenty five years. They were married for twenty five years. That man never got her name tattooed, and that was like. And then start over with the maybe grandkids. Maybe the right decision. <laughs> so I'm like, look, girl. <laughs> <laughs> you, no, you owe me. It's one thing to have your daughters. I you don't know all of them. You, you, you got grandkids. And you got like seven grandkids. That's why like now, Hector, you know me. <laughs> I gave you my best. You're you going to get my name. <laughs> That's why I'm waiting for Marcus to get me tattooed on somebody. Are you going to get it? He he said I it once upon a time. I Go see. ahead. Bald and beautiful. No, say what you said in the body. original. No, say the original. I don't remember. What did I say? Say the original. He said he was going to get my name tattooed on your leg. I was young and dumb. Uh, it was just stupid. This thing, uh, are you going to get a tattoo to um, Angel? Am I what a Of a Marcus. Well, because of, his, uh, he has a Marcus. Listen has, to this excuse. He has a son named after him. He is automatically on me oh. if I get my children. Name. That don't count. It was not finagled way, but I'm kind of here for it. Do you it? have your kids? That's why I name? switched it up and I, I said on this oh. one. I said on this one, I'm just gonna get a halo on the A. What's on your? Nah, iPad? you can't get the logo, man. That don't count. He said the logo. Halo. Oh, halo <laughs> the you got a car named Halo, so that's what it could stand for. It could, but it don't. <laughs> I want my name tattooed on her neck. <laughs> I settled for the belly button piercing. I don't care. I was freaked out about the tattoo. Huh? I settled for the belly button piercing because I freaked out on the tattoo. Yeah, she had thought about it. I wanted her to get cast. I went in. With two arrows. I went into the tattoo parlor and I heard that little buzzing sound. Uh -huh. I was like, I'm, I'm not built for this. Like I said, belly button ring. <laughs> what were you going in there to get? I, that was the other thing I wasn't quite convinced. I thought I was going to get a butterfly. And I was like, is the butterfly going to show up on my skin? Like, I had all these questions. I just wasn't sure. And so I ended up getting my belly button pierced. Then I took that out. And then I got my tragus pierced. And then I was like, that's oh, what yeah. I enjoy. Oh, yeah, she gets all these holes in her ears. Yeah, I got two up here, Probably like one over here. And I want to get like two more. Oh, come on, let's do Okay, yeah, piercing, I'm I'm cool with getting another piercing. But do a tattoo. I'm not doing a tattoo. I've just decided. She said I can't. <laughs> She's like, I've just decided. One day, the right tattoo is going to come across your eye. You're going to be like, now that could be I nice. need to see it on someone with like deeply, richly melanated skin. And so then you colors. are similar colors. Yeah, we're similar colors. Uh, we're not, though. Ma Melissa, I, I swear she's darker than everybody on Earth. But I'm definitely Earth. 375. You're like 350. Maybe I'm 357. No, if you're, you're 375. What, what are mean? If you're 375, Maybe. I'm 370. You oh, you <laughs> being that. I'm 370. Are y'all really calling out oven temperatures? <laughs> 
That's the I most thought it was like a makeup term. That's the most mob thing I've ever heard of. Marvin, yeah. you, you 200, though. Yeah. You are a sipper. You're, you're keep warm. You are warm. <laughs> you are. <laughs> they said keep warm. Marcus is under the oven. You know you have the stuff under the oven. You keep me warm. He's that first chick under preheat. Yeah, you don't belong in the beige, boy. You don't belong in this conversation. Preheat. <laughs> he said beige boy <laughs> fool <laughs> Melissa we are not that I wore your foundation Melissa my thinks she is darker than everyone I literally wore her foundation in the makeup did tutorial she? she did <laughs> my foundation will blend into your skin And but I'm, what I'm trying to say is that <laughs> you can get a tattoo with color on it you have a tattoo with color? yes well, let me see it's on my hair oh. <laughs> I'm not about to get a dress is that your only tattoo? yeah oh I'm only getting one more tattoo. That's it. <laughs> what if, oh, hey, hey. Was that your first straight tattoo? No, I, I, would, I had said something and I had it in my mouth. Been been what? Yeah, I've been the there. only tattoo I would get is right here. Okay. That was like it. my wedding anniversary. Perfect. Do it. Y'all gonna be together forever. <laughs> Come on. I'm here for that. I've been thinking about tattoos. I feel that like that's like, gonna hurt though. It's on your bones. Yeah. Angel is gonna hurt. I wanna get Doug life right here. Angel is the biggest peer pressure person I know. I am a peer encourager. Big difference. I encourage. I encourage experiences. I gotta get another grill, y'all. They, they have great memories. TSA stole my grill. Me too. I gotta get another grill too. I've been doing the design, and I have to get it. Is that not where you work? No, he's working at the airport. Oh, I'm about to be like, bro, that's not the gig you. That's not me. I don't work for the airport. He just works. We are remodeling the airport. Oh, airport adjacent. Yeah, got you. He be at the airport. Airport adjacent. No. Wow. It was strong. Yeah. <laughs> it's so much. <laughs> it's so a lot. <laughs> uh, I mean, usually, like, Marcus be drinking stuff meat. He be a drinking rock gut stuff. Stuff that is just. I tend to drink yeah, things that are cold. Marcus be drinking it meat. No. Oh. But it's neat. You feel the flavor more. Yeah, she loves meat stuff. Wait, I, I want to taste it. I, Girl, I thought you had some. I did. I started drinking the rose. I just finished it up. Melissa do not be drinking that dark like that. No, I don't. Do Why not. are you going to do it, Melissa? Because I just, it's experience. Just try, try it, try now it. Now don't sip that because it's going to be awful. You got to just let that. Yeah, let it taste tea. like, smell like it would be good in a dessert though. It yes, does. It does. It does. Mm -hmm. It's brandy. You made it. You made With that peach cobbler. Yeah, that yeah. was. Ian Where Jay. people mess up is when they like take a little sip. It's, it's dumb. Okay, stop talking. Do not compare this to Ian Jay though. That is, that's disrespectful. What's Ian Jay? Very that's disrespectful. That you, you said E and J. Why did I think of the personality trait? Because <laughs> you're too intelligent. Okay, here we go. Yeah, yeah, we got to shoot a whole nother video. I'm sorry. Hmm. <laughs> you praying to say grace? I had to bring. Get ready. <laughs> I thought you were about to take it like a champ and she then you got to exhale. You got to exhale, Liz. She did it for three seconds. Yeah. You gotta yeah. exhale when you yeah. yeah. like, I gotta make it go down. <laughs> right. It's a it's shut up in your bones. I get it. I get it. No, it do be it be sitting right there mm -hmm. in the top of your chest. It be right there. Mm -hmm. It's so <laughs> You much. thought you was gonna blow fire. Wine and then chase it with <laughs> with brandy. Well, like, you had no. me do it. She backwards. Man. You shouldn't do it either. You should have said no. She yeah. have said no. You been like, first of all, you don't tell me what I can drink. I'm gonna burn you a sandwich. We got that. a brandy chaser. <laughs> yeah. Brandy, yeah. Drink some water, wine, and yeah. I'm gonna finish it off with brandy. I need some. Like, you need to coke. go the other way around. I need to go. I want that in slow motion. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that thing was going down I like want. a big ball. <laughs> Mondays and do this on a separate Seven. thing. Oh no, no, a separate day. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We really didn't talk about much about that <laughs> I don't think we're going to be, the mukbang going to be like 22% of the title is going to be what we actually talk about. Yeah. I mean, just be right. surprised. Whoa. Hey. hey. <laughs> ah. 
<laughs> the brand is coming back. I, I was like, that gotta be the Ciroc. The way it's, that's coming out, it's coming out. It's coming out the other way. I didn't even know that was happening. It's hot. <laughs> it was hot. Sorry. It's not your skirt. I, I usually know it's coming. I'm a slobber. Golly. <laughs> I can say stop. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's not your skirt. 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 You had it till, till Marcus showed me. Did he listen to me, Kevin? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I hope you enjoy this all uh, black uh, everything. Uh, like it was an all black everything. All black everything. Every I love day. that. I think we should continue that. Yeah, I like it. It's nice. It. nice. I, I'm here for it. That's why we can do Jamaican food next time. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. All black everything. Jamaican food, y'all. So again, y'all know where to I go to fish. see content from us. Um, Patreon is getting the unedited version of this. So I hope mm -hmm. you all, if you want to see it, you know where you got to go. Um, like, subscribe, and share. And uh, we'll see you all next time. Peace. Bye. Peace. Y'all go, families. That chick angel. Yo, she's comedy.